So on this week's topic about American interventionism, let's talk about the Barbary Wars. Which, if you don't know what that is, that is the series of conflicts that America fought in the early 1800s when they went and invaded North Africa to end a bunch of pirates. You see, the Barbary Coast was this region all across North Africa where there were a series of nominal independent kingdoms that were, technically speaking, vassals to the Ottoman Empire. These places were absolutely filled with pirates, pirates who were working under the government to go and attack European merchantmen in order to steal cargo and, more importantly, to take people as slaves and sell them for ransom. They did this to everyone, including America, and it pissed off America so much that instead of paying the ransom, they decided to instead raise the money to build a fleet and go destroy the pirates. So they did. Twice. The first Barbary War was between 1801 and 1805, and after an American victory, American ships were mostly left alone. But hostilities resumed again in the War of 1812 because during that time, Britain basically told the pirates, hey, you should raid the Americans. To which the Americans responded in 1815 by getting the fleet together and crushing them. And after that, American ships were left alone.